Hey everyone, it's Dr. Twisted, and I'm back with another story time. It's a doozy of a twosie. Alright, so I'm a custodian. I work at an elementary cleaning the kindergarten first grade area. But before I tell you the story, I gotta tell you a couple other things. Alright, so a while ago we had a game night, and our friends brought up something called a poop knife and I've never heard of this poop knife so we found out what it was and I was like that's crazy I've destroyed some toilets in my time but I have never dropped a load so big where you had to chop it down with a machete but anyway on to the original story so I'm cleaning up this bathroom and I'm on the girl's side. I open the stall, and oh my god, there's this giant. I don't know if you ever watched the movie Grumlins, but it looked like a cocoon after you fed him after midnight in this toilet. And I tried to flush it like 10 times, and it wasn't budging. And I was like, if there's any time I would have needed a poop knife, it would have been now. But, I didn't have a poop knife. I was like, what am I going to do? I ended up having to grab an empty toilet paper roll and poking that thing down. And, I hope I never have to deal with that again. That is disgusting. I don't know what you people are feeding your kids, but somebody that young... Should not be dropping gizmo cockacoons that huge. I imagine that child is walking bull-legged the rest of the day. That had to hurt. Stop feeding your children. Stop it. <laughs>